America, fast food central. There are 50 million Americans that eat fast food every single day. That's one in seven people. It's no secret. Many fast food meals are loaded with carbs, fat, and lots of calories. But what about the superstars? What about the ones that stand out the most? The biggest and the unhealthiest items on our fast food menus. The fast food items with the highest amount of calories. In 2020, an article was published detailing the highest calorie items at 30 top fast food restaurants. In this video, One Hungry Idiot used that article as inspiration in his attempt to consume the top 10 highest calorie fast food items in America. This is his story. Well, what can I say? Sometimes you gotta go big or you gotta go. All right, so the first stop is Burger King. I'm here for the, the BK Triple Stacker. Apparently it has like 1,300 calories in it. I hope they have it. I'm actually curious, do you guys have the, the Triple Stacker still? Triple Stacker? We do have the Double Stacker. You have the Double but not the Triple? Yeah, you want the Triple yeah. Stacker? Yeah, the triple stacker. Yeah, we have it. You want the combo? Yes, a sandwich. Just the just the actual sandwich, please. Yes, a sandwich. Okay. And then I'm gonna get a uh, medium diet coke, and that'll be it. Chris, oh my gosh, it look like I look like a foot. Eric looks like a foot in this video. Awesome, thank you. You have a great day, all right? Thank you. Sonic time! I love Sonic. It's very good and delicious, just not so nutritious. Ooh, cinnamon cinna snacks. 640 calories, not gonna be enough. Large peanut butter Oreo shake, 1720 calories in a peanut butter shake. That's pretty absurd. <laughs> how do you how do you fit 720 calories in a shake? How's it going? Um, I was actually hoping to get one of your large peanut butter Oreo shakes, please. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get your supersonic bacon double cheeseburger, please, with, uh, with mayo. Thanks, brother. Take care. Now we're here at the Bell because there's an item called the Grande Beef Nachos Box. So the Grande Beef Nachos Box clocks in at a whopping 1130 calories. And I also gotta remind you all that these are single items. I could theoretically order 12 tacos and stuff them together and call it one item, but no, we're just doing single items in this video. Single items meant for one person. Hi there, um, I was hoping to get your uh, Grande Beef Nachos Box, please. Sure thing, it comes with a drink, what would you like? Uh, I'll have a Diet Coke. That'll, that'll be fine. Thank you very much. You have a good day, all right? You Can you guys do the the Grande Sausage Burrito right now? Okay, perfect. I'm gonna get one of those, please. Grande Sausage Burrito from Jack in the Box. 1,070 calories for one burrito. Awesome, thank you, have a good day. All right, everybody, so it's Carl's Jr. time, and I just gotta say, I know there are those of you that are vegans, vegetarians, that watch me, so, you know, I'm gonna dedicate this, this part of the video to you right now, because we're getting something that's vegan slash vegetarian, I think. How's it going? Um, you guys still have your Beyond Burgers? I'm sorry? Do you guys still have your Beyond Burgers? Yeah, of course. Cool, um, can you guys do a double? Yeah, we can do a double. Yeah, I'll do a, a double Beyond Burger, please. Uh, which one, the famous or Beyond? Barbecue. One is, uh, what, uh, barbecue sauce and onion rings, and one is pickle, lettuce, tomato, I'll do the barbecue one, please. All right. Okay, go ahead and go to the front. Thanks. It's kind of weird. Thanks a lot, man. All right, guys, so now we're here at Wendy's. Now everybody, ooh, Wendy's has breakfast? Why am I just now finding out about that? That might need to be in next week's video, which is, if I haven't said it already, is gonna be a, <laughs> that's gonna be a big one. So apparently Wendy's triple bacon jalapeno cheeseburger has 1,170 calories in it. So that's what we're gonna be getting tonight. And if you guys know me, you know I hate spicy things. Unfortunately, the regular version of this cheeseburger was 20 calories less. Hi there, do you guys have your, uh, your triple bacon jalapeno cheeseburger? Okay, uh, ready to combo? Uh, no, just a sandwich. Awesome. Thanks so much. Take care. Awesome. Thanks so much. Pizza acquired. Now it's time to get to our next destination. I'm going to go ahead and do your, uh, your peanut butter mood. Please, can I get a large? Alright, everybody. We have 
our final item. Now it's time to get all this home and it's time to get this food challenge officially started. Alrighty, everybody, we have all of our items here. Uh, let's, goodness gracious, everybody, this is gonna be, this is gonna be insane. Oh man, I'm starving. So let's just get everything unwrapped and get everything all. That was really lame, but I'm gonna go with that. Presentable. Sonic threw in some breath mints. Perfect. All right, Pizza Hut, I see you. Okay, so let's do a quick little run through of everything just to make sure we have all of our items here. That being said, I also have some additional beverages over here just in case I'm gonna need them. We have a ton of savory items right here along with 2,600 calories of sweetness in these two containers right here. I think I'm gonna be able to get this down in a reasonable amount of time. That being said, everyone, I'm gonna give myself 45 minutes to complete this challenge. If you guys think I can take all of this down in 45 minutes, comment down below, salty, because I see a bunch of saltiness in front of me right now. That being said, Electric Empire, it's time for me to let you guys know the total calories that are in this challenge. Those are gonna be listed like right there you guys and total macros that means protein carbs fat sodium and sugar total macros are gonna be listed like right there for you guys without further ado my friends my family this is the i ate the top 10 highest calorie fast food menu items challenge let's do this Seventeen hundred and twenty calories in this shake goodness gracious all right all right, folks, I think we're gonna start with our Wendy's Triple Jalapeno Baconator. All right, everybody, here we go in three, two, and one. That was a lot of meat. That's what she said. <laughs> All right, everyone, well, three minutes and 11 seconds in, our first burger's down, half our shake is down. Shout out to all the vegans down below. I love you guys. Okay, not bad. We're gonna get a fire. Whatever we walk, six minutes, 50 seconds in. So far, so good. So far, so good. I think what we're gonna do right now is go move on over to our next shake right here. And also, I think, get into our nachos because, ooh, I'll pick that up later. Our nachos, they've been tainted with guacamole. If you guys know me, I'm not the biggest fan of guacamole, but uh, I'm taking one for the team here. Just wait for that crunch. Wait for that crunch. Now, gotta get into our shake. I think I had this in my 15,000 calories in 50 minutes video. If you guys wanna see another video like that, let me know. Ooh. Cherries. Wow. That's delicious. You guys know. I didn't delay the, the moment we're about to have. But that is gonna get a W. Oh, W moment. You guys know I love my peanut butter. I think I have something on my nose. Oh. All right, everybody, well, our shake is down, nachos are down. We are 18, 18 minutes and 16 seconds into this. I feel like I just took a bath and a bunch of Taco Bell and a shake, which I basically just did. I think now it's time to move over to our pizza. Now, just so you guys know, stuffed crust is the only way to go. Now, meat lovers, it's certainly great too. Got some lightweight because, well, 
Sometimes we just gotta watch our calories. And there you have it, everyone. You guys know, pizza and ranch. It's just a way of life. There we go. Hmm. Alright everybody, well, pizza's down. Just spruce this up with some mac and cheese. Yeah, white, ooh, this is white cheddar mac and cheese with more bacon on it. This is actually the first time that Panera is making an appearance in an Eric the Electric video, so shout out to Panera. That is gourmet deliciousness right there. Let's, let's try it out, let's try it out. Officially, 30 minutes and 18 seconds in. Our pizza is in. I forgot about my mac and cheese. Ooh. Let's get this down. Mac and cheese is down. Oh my goodness. Man, I really underestimated this challenge. I mean, sometimes I do, sometimes I don't, but this one was a definite yes. Good thing we're at breakfast, and you guys know how much I love breakfast. Oh, it's got hash browns in it. Oh. Alright, well, well, 35 minutes and 23 seconds. Into this challenge. Oh, that's the last thing that I want to see right now. Like, that is just unnecessary, Sonic. Unnecessary right there. You really need to put that much cheese and mayo on a cheeseburger? Oh, my goodness. Speaking of unnecessary, I've had way too much meat tonight. That's what she said. Like, that is... Goodness. What you're about to see is probably going to look gross. I'm sorry, but I don't like failing challenges. And you know, you just gotta do what you gotta do, everybody. Well, at least we got some, some veggies in today. Maybe I should go vegan. Uh, actually, never mind. <sighs> oh my goodness gracious, did they really put bagels on this burger? Oh, no. Oh. seconds. If you guys are still with the flow of the video. Oh, comment meat. Because I've eaten a lot of meat tonight. <laughs> 44 minutes and 44 seconds. Oh, goodness. That was, that was a lot more food than I expected. Regardless, everybody. If you guys enjoy this week's video, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. I'm gonna put another crazy fast food challenge right there for you guys to watch, along with my fast food playlist right there so you guys can keep watching more Eric the Electric and keep enjoying more food challenges with me. Subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. Don't forget to hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in next week's video.